in terms of installing the Monet Rally computer um, that I needed to do was just figure out where I wanted to mount the Rally computer. So um, given that it's a door mounted uh, Rally computer and not uh, mounted on the dash again, uh, because the uh, co-driver wouldn't be able to reach it from uh, a buckled and harness position. Uh, I just needed to figure out, uh, just do some real um, easy, quick uh, measuring in terms of like where the um, the Monet Rally computer would end up when the door is closed. Um, so uh, it, we're, the whole goal was to kind of tuck it in um, right here so that when the door is closed, um, you're seated, um, it would kind of fit in the uh, sort of the corner of uh, of the door bars here. So all right so what i've done um as of this point is um i removed my door panel um and again first took some basic um uh, some rough measurements of like where i wanted it um actually have a slight angle um so it's not perfectly parallel with the um the door line i actually wanted it mounted up slightly uh because of where the seated position is um, it would be a, a nice uh, angle um, for the screen to be right in the uh, co-driver's point of view. So uh, again, the hardware that it comes with um, is real nice. Um, for me in this case, I did have to um, uh, just cut off the extra excess um, screws here. They, the screws that they give you are actually quite long um, and it would not uh, sit flush with uh, my door panel here um, when the the door panels uh, it, you know back installed and in place um, so really it's just those four screws i uh, the hardware didn't actually end up coming with washers um, i did put some washers on here um, just to kind of strengthen um, and just keep everything sort of in place um, and i also used um, some blue thread lock um, to keep the nut um, in place on the screw so it's pretty much it um, and then again over here on the back of the computer um, it's really just two uh, two small screws um, and again I just put a little bit of thread locker on the back of there uh, as well just to hold it in place I've been working on the wiring for a bit um, just trying to get a really nice uh, um, tight connection here. So I've um, already kind of laid the uh, some of the uh, wiring for the rally computer through some wiring protector. Um, I drilled a few holes um, in the door panel. Um, so I'm going to secure that uh, in here. Um, once I've got everything lined up and making sure that um, everything reaches uh, to the battery. Um, and then obviously, um, the GPS uh, head unit bulkhead unit um, as well uh, before I secure anything down fully. Um, but I've got all the wiring there um, ready to go. So just kind of prepping everything before I can just lay it out. All right, guys, the next step uh, in installing the Monet Rally computer is to install the GPS unit. Uh, so this is the, the bulkhead unit, um, which is going to go into our roof. So what I've done now uh, is to simply drill a hole um, using just a drill uh, into the roof and um, size it correctly so that the uh, screw for the sensor or for the GPS unit um, will be able to just kind of screw down into place. So we can obviously kind of make the hole a little bit bigger if we need to, but I'm gonna to try to keep it as tight as possible um, in order to get a good seal, so. Okay, so once the GPS unit um, is nice and flush against the roof of your car, uh, the next step is to go inside um, and secure the nut, uh, but we're gonna run the uh, washer and the lock nut uh, up against the uh, the ceiling of the roof, so uh, very easy. Uh, and now we have the wire coming down for uh, the other connection. So at this point, we just need to 
uh, tidy up the wiring. Uh, we have some other uh, wiring that we're working on. So we're just gonna basically uh, tidy up everything else and run this guy down our A pillar uh, to the front uh, and then connect into uh, the wiring protector uh, right here and then run that uh, back behind the uh, and connect it to our uh, Monet Rally computer. Uh, and then the power is gonna go into the back of the car where our battery is located um, back here. So we've uh, finished the install. We have the GPS nice and flush, nice and tight. Inside, we have our Monet G100, nicely wired up. And we've done probably 90% of the wiring uh, in terms of like just tucking it back inside and everything. Um, but should be pretty good. And let's test it out. We've got the computer installed. Got a real nice fitment uh, right in between the, right in the corner here of the uh, roll cage. And let's give it a shot. It looks like it's in currently in sleep mode right now, but hitting any button should wake it up. Nice. All right. Stopwatch works. Yeah, and you can see that the GPS is connected right now. Uh, so it looks like it has a really great signal. Start and stop. Clear it. Change the mode here to distance traveled. Miles, current miles per hour. Max speed, back to your stopwatch. You've got your top display too. Obviously we haven't traveled anywhere. We're sitting in a garage. And we got the menu. Um, so for now, it looks like it's working great. All right, well, hopefully everybody enjoyed the video and looking forward to getting this Monit Rally computer out on the road.